Hello world, my name is BenBeats57, and today we're going to do a Let's Play of Terraria version, what is that, 1.2.4.1. Um, yeah, this is a, a new Let's Play, I'm starting this because uh, I know there's another version of Terraria coming out soon that's going to be an updated one, uh, so I just want to get more familiar with the mechanics and the progression system and all that. Um, so let's just go ahead and jump in, this is actually my first ever Let's Play, so this is my Hello World. Let's play. Um, all right, let's get going. Uh, let's see. How do I want my guy to look? Um, huh. No, no. Tempting, but no. Uh, no, it's a guy. That's not going to work. That's not going to work either. Nope. Um, no. You know what? Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Let's get that more of a... a mm, what color? Blue? Nah. Brown. I'll be boring on that one. Eyes? Ooh, let's do blue eyes. Yeah. Oh, wrong slider. I can't even tell. Can you tell? Yeah, I can't really tell. Oh, well. Skin... He's definitely a white guy. So let's see. Oh, that's no, that's like unhealthy. Nope, that's fine. Clo what's this? Soft core? What? You know, I'll do. Uh, let's do medium core on this one. Let's make it a little more difficult. All right, let's do. Let's do clothes now. I'm wearing a green shirt. Because, actually, green's like my favorite color. So, we'll do that. Why are my sleeves... Oh, undershirt. Uh, let's see if I can get it the same color. Yeah, that looks good. Now for pants. Um, thinking more like blue jeans. Yeah. There we go. Shoes. I'm wearing black shoes. That's how I do it. All right. So there's my guy. Um, I need a name. I'll just call him Beats. His name is Beats. No. Nope. Little Beats. Yeah. Cause I'm Beats. This is Little Beats. So let's play with Little Beats. Um. Yeah, let's uh, let's delete some of this. Because we're starting a brand new world, and these are all just ones that I just I don't really play on anymore, and they're gone anyways. So you know, they're gone. So let's do a new one. Let's do medium. Uh, let's see, what should I call it? Beats World. Oh, capital B. Typed it too fast. Beats world. Actually, shouldn't that be an apostrophe? Possessive. Beats his world. Something like that. Alright, so let's get this thing going. So, I'm... I don't really remember a lot of the stuff from this game. I haven't played it in a while. So, I might have some difficulty crafting things. I might forget what ingredients I need and all that. Uh, thankfully, thankfully, there's the guide, though, so it shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, so first thing I want to do, I want to get a house going. Uh, at least have room for the guide to stay in so he doesn't get just murdered at night. Then I want to start some mining, get some materials that I'll need to get some armor going, and uh, uh, some good weapons. So, all right, well, this is perfect because there's trees right here. I can just get these knocked down. Um, it looks like... I actually look kind of yellow. I look a little sick. Oh well. So it looks like we've got lead in this world and tin. So I don't know if that's any indication on whether this is a crimson world or a corruption. Um, I don't know if that... I don't know if that tells me anything. I guess we'll see. I know on one of the worlds I played last, uh, I had lead and tin and it was a... Uh, crimson and a hollowed world. So maybe that's what this world is. Or maybe I'm completely misunderstanding all of that. 
I don't know. So I'm just gonna knock these trees down. I don't really know how much wood I need. I'd like to get some stone though too. I like the look of the stone background, like the stone walls on the house. I probably won't be able to get sand for windows. Um, unless I do some more exploring, try to figure out what's around me. And there was a duck just going to town over there. It's kind of driving me nuts. Oh. Oh, that was brutal. You just decapitated the thing. I'll avenge you. Your life has been revenged, rabbit. Actually reminds me, last summer my dad ran over a rabbit and kind of like cut off its head. It was a baby rabbit. It was, it was actually kind of sad. But the thing is, like, it wasn't dead. Like, it cut off, like, the top of its head. Sort of. I don't really know how it happened, but somehow it survived and we had to get our neighbor to put it down. It was a little tough, you know. Alright. So let's get some of that oh, slime. I need a better sword. This is... How can I not hit you? There we go. Get over here. Alright. You're next. Yeah. Ah. Alright, let's get some of this tin. Is this tin? Yeah, it's tin. So I do remember what tin looks like. And I remember what lead looks like. So it's coming back to me. Even though I haven't played this in a while. What's my guide's name? Scott. It's actually really fitting. Huh. My best friend growing up, his name was Scott. So hopefully this guy doesn't die. Although, if I remember right, in order to summon the Wall of Flesh to advance to hard mode, I, I do need to kill this guy. So, well, that's really tragic. There are a lot of trees here. I'm liking this. Also, I am moving slow. I need those Boots of Hermes, like, quick. Oh, I forgot how slow you are when you start off. Um... Alright, looks like there's a jar down here. Let me... No, actually, I don't want to go down there because I don't know how to get back up. And I don't want to take the time to do that. Um, so I'm thinking... I'm thinking this spot is actually going to be really good for a house. Once I get these trees chopped down. So I'll just do that. And you are right in my way, dude. You need to, like, you need to move. Or... Really? Okay. I thought he was just going to stand right on top of me so I couldn't chop that tree down. Yeah, you deserve it. For getting in my way. Hmm. And also, I think... Um... If you catch like worms and frogs, you can use those as bait for fishing. I haven't really done a lot of fishing though from my other playthroughs, so I'm not exactly sure how that works. Another rabbit just mutilated. Cut down in the prime of life. All right, let's see what I can get. I need some torches. That's definitely a must have. Um, make some wood platforms. 15 should be enough. I won't plant any trees yet. Um, hmm. Let me, let me level this out. I don't like building a house that's not on level ground. I don't know. Maybe for you guys it's fine, but for me it just drives me nuts. Because then you just have uneven layers, and it's... I don't know. Maybe I'm just too picky about that. Ooh, a butterfly. Okay, so one, two, three, four, six. Alright. I think this is big enough for... I don't even know how many I just put down there. Oh, that should be big enough. Let's get a door. Oh, I need a, need a workbench first. Let's get a workbench. Some more torches. Okay. Um, yeah. So I 
Apparently can't kill the butterfly? Unless it's flying like right below where I can swing. Yep, it was. Okay. I know. I'm a horrible person. I just killed that butterfly. Which I'm gonna need three doors. So one, two, and where's my there it is. I'm gonna make another room here. This'll be where my guide stays. And are these It's not it's not wide enough. Sorry, I'm just I'm super picky about this sometimes. Um I think that should be even. Alright, this is your room. You stay here. This is my room. Alright, so what else do I need? I think I need a chair, I think, and a table. And I think that's all they need in order to, like, in order for the for the game to recognize it as a livable room. It's just a table and a chair. Or it's like two pieces of furniture or something, I don't know. I don't know exactly what the requirements are. Oh, I didn't know I could stand on that. Huh. Oh, whatever. Is there anything else I can make? Um, no. I don't have enough lead. Or is it... What do I need to make an anvil? Maybe I don't have enough of that stuff. Alright, let's get some armor going. It's not much, but it's something. And I need a better sword. Let's get that. I need a hammer. Um, no, I don't really want a bow. I don't really have a use for it now. Do I need anything else? Um, yeah, I'll get a campfire. Why not? Here we go. So I need more stone to make this stone wall. To complete my house. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Want more gel? Give me, give me your gel. Okay. Here we go. Your life is spared for now, Mr. Squirrel. I've decided to be benevolent towards you. All right, what's in these? Ooh, shuriken. Copper coin. So I got some money. That's cool. Let's get some of this lead. Uh, I'm just going to explore a little bit, see, see what's on the map here. Coins, torches, other stuff. Potion. Ooh, rope. That'll be good. Ouch. Okay. And these, oh, these little floating things right here, they drive me nuts too. I think it's my ADD side, or not my ADD, my OCD side coming out. Because I always feel like I have to, like, tear all this up and remove it so I don't have to deal with it. I'm weird sometimes. Alright, let's kill this. There we go. Give me your gubs. Give me your gubs. There we go. Ouch. Um. Well, I saw enough of what I wanted to see over there. I'm more interested in getting this house done than exploring right now. So we'll get to that probably next time. I'll do some more exploring. Um, at night, I'll probably do some spelunking. Just to get some minerals, start working on upgrading my stuff as soon as possible. So I can just move on to the next tier. Um, also, I'm not sure if you guys are going to have any difficulty seeing what I see when I mine. I know sometimes that I look at Let's Plays of Terraria. When people go mining, maybe it's my screen, but I just... It gets so dark, I can't even see what they're doing. So I'm just looking at a, at a black screen, and they're talking about stuff going on. And I all I see is the text on the screen. So I also want to get a mining helmet when I can, just to make it easier for, for you guys to see what's going on. Because I know some of you might not be able to see 
Um, here we go. There. Ouch. Ouch. Yeah, you can go away. I don't need you. Let's just go over here. It's getting to be nighttime, so I want to get these walls up. I closed myself out of my house. That's great. Stone walls. Get some more of those. There we go. Alright. So let's put these up. Here we go. And I'll just fill the whole thing for now. Normally I leave a spot to put like a window, but since um, I haven't explored enough to find any sand to make glass, I'm just going to close all this. If I remember right, and I could be totally wrong about this, but earlier versions of Terraria, like when it first came out, required that you have a window in a room in order for an NPC to live in it. I think. Alright, I think that's everything. Oh, there's some spots here. And that's sticking out, so I'll take that off. Alright, so we should be good. Let me see if... Can you not live here? Yeah, you can live here. You can totally live here, dude. There it is. Scott. Scott the guide. He's right there. So we're approaching nighttime, so zombies is going to be a thing. So I will try to keep you defended, Scott. I shall do my best. And I still can't make an anvil. I have 18 lead. Do I make it out of tin? I don't... What am I missing here? Do I... Um, I don't know... Huh. Yeah, I do not remember a lot of this. Clearly, because I don't even know what to do next. Like, because I need to smelt some things, but I don't know how to make a... Do I get a smelter? Or do I do all that with the anvil? I don't think I do. I'm pretty sure I don't use an anvil for smelting. Oh, there's a cave over there. Um, I might go check that out. Let me just put a torch up here so I can see what I'm doing. Wow. Oh, wait. Do I have to make it out of stone? Do I make an anvil out of stone? Is that what it is? Maybe that's why I can't see it, because I've been using all my stone for stone walls. I guess that would make sense. Alright, so the eyes are already coming after me. And it's a purple one. I don't believe I've seen that before. Is it a special one? Huh. I don't know. Get out of here. Okay, you're... Nope. Go away. Hopefully they aren't breaking into my house right now and just mutilating my helper. That would be pretty awful. I blew- oh. Uh, Alright, so this could be a bad situation. Get away. Oh, this thing just does not have a lot of knockback. There, get... Oh, wow. 11 damage. Hmm. Yeah, my armor... Well, I mean, I only have three armor, right? Yeah, three defense. That's not going to protect me from much. So let's see what's over here. I mean, why not, right? We stumbled on a cave. So I'll do some spelunking now, and that was a bigger fall than I thought it would be. get out of here. I need to get up. Um, where's my rope? There it is. I'll just use that. 
I love how you can just use rope to climb up. Even... Ah, even if... Stop it! I'm talking! Even if you're in midair, you can just climb all the way up. That's how I got access to a lot of the islands in my other world, is I just built these ropes going all the way up. Makes it uh, pretty convenient. Stay away from me, please. Ouch, that really hurt. Yep, that, that really hurt too. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my house now. Put a torch there. I put a lot of torches down over there. I'm gonna take some of those off. Don't need that one. I don't really need that one either. Eh, that's fine. Oh. So apparently you can jump that, so that's not cool for me. If that eye comes in here... Wow, I'm already almost at half health. You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna die my first night. It's horrible. Ooh, a star. That's not too bad. Alright, so Scott's still alive. That's good. What up, Scott? Oh. Heard another star. Stay inside, Scott. There. All right, so good thing I put that, uh, what is that, a fire pit? What's that called? A campfire. Good thing I put that campfire there. It's healing me. All right, so I guess it wasn't stone after all. So is there anything I can do? Huh. What can I do? And another star. What do you know? It's my lucky night. I'll just do some more digging. Because apparently I'm just missing materials that I need to make an anvil. Or whatever I need. I know I can make an anvil with something. I just need to find it. Not seeing anything over there. Nothing here. Oh, is that something? No, that's just stone. Alright, you can get back. Some of you might be thinking I'm just wasting a lot of torches. Really, I'm only doing that so that if I run through here again, um, I won't have to have a torch out in order to see. Also, it's, just in case anyone's watching this, like I said before, and you just... You know, you just think it's too dark. Um, I'm trying to prevent that, so. And this is just stone. I need like lead or tin. I just need more of that, I think. Maybe I just don't have enough. I'm pretty sure you make an anvil with lead. And there's some right there, so let me, let me get to that. Still just racking my brain trying to figure out what are the what are the actual items that I need to start smelting things and just making better armor. The only one I can think of is the anvil. I'm pretty sure there's something else though. Hmm. I probably should have done a little bit more research before I started playing this. Because I'm I'm probably just looking super stupid right now. But I'm okay with that. All right, and a, a yellow slime. That's awesome. So this is, oh, this is the part where I die, right? This is where I'm dying. Uh, I hope not. Uh, how do I? Okay. Close one, and I don't have any health potions. Oh, nope, I do. I lied. Actually, let me put that there. It's just how I arrange my stuff, because I use a a gaming mouse, like the 12, 
12 button on this, like where the thumb is, one of those mouses, like the MMO mouse. So I'm just used to having things keyed to a certain spot. Actually, my health potions I normally have set at 7. So it just makes it easier to switch between weapons and items like that. Like rope is 7, torch is 10. Oh, I only have two torches. That's not good. There we go. 65. No big deal. Okay. So, yeah, this isn't really working out for me right now. I've only been able to f I've only been able to find like five lead. Is that gonna help me? No. I'm just looking like a fool right now. But really, I'm just trying to get my bearings. It's a new world. It's a new game. So, you know, just learning. All right, let's see what's down. There's something going on over here. I'd like to check that out. Maybe there's some easy to access minerals or ores. And apparently it's just dirt. Well, stone. And this guy. <sighs> this is just not my day. I can't find anything. I guess I'll just mine stone. Oh my. Going down. Where are those platforms? Here they are. I get some of those set up so I can easily get back out. Still nothing. And is, is it daytime yet? Yep. I hear the music changing. Alright, so I think that'll about... Oh, I forgot to lay platforms. Judas. Alright. Hmm. So I'm thinking... Uh... Wow. That was, that was really a waste of a night. I didn't get anything done. I'm disappointed. But what I think, what I think I'm going to do is, uh, once I wrap this up, um, we'll just call it a game. Oh, maybe if I get some of this, maybe I'll have enough lead ore now to make something. I mean, I got 42. Surely I can get to the workbench and make something out of 42 pieces of lead ore. Anyways, uh, so I'm thinking once I wrap this up, then before my next episode of this Let's Play, I'll do a little bit more research, try to figure out like what I need to get uh, like material-wise in order to keep progressing. Because, yeah, my not knowing what to get in this episode really, really screwed me up. Like I said, I didn't get anything done during the night just because I just, I didn't know what to get. I was thinking more ore, but then I didn't really know what kind of ore. Maybe lead, maybe tin. Maybe I should have done more surface exploring. Eh, kind of a rough start, I'll admit. Not that great, but hey, it happens. We all have our rough patches. And this tree is just out in the middle of nowhere, hanging out. I'm gonna kill this green slime first. There we go. So I feel a little better from that. So let's see. Where's my guide? Oh, there he is. There's Scott. 
So let's see if I can do anything now. Oh, furnace. There we go. That's what I need. Oh, 20 stone. Wooden torches. Okay. Yep, that's what I needed. So let's put that... That doesn't go there. There we go. Let's get some smelted lead. Or whatever, you know, a lead bar. Let's get some of that tin. Um, yeah, let's get that anvil going too. Put that there. Let's see what I can do. A tin broadsword. Uh, what's better, tin or lead? I think lead is better. Let's see, a tin broadsword, 9 damage. Lead broadsword, 11. How much is that? 8. Um, should I get that first? What's my current one? 7. I'm thinking, yeah. I'm thinking, get the better sword. Yep. I'm feeling good about that choice. Yeah. Yeah, I'm feeling good about that choice. Let's get some more torches. Alright, 3 torches. Let's get 3 torches. Alright, so what else do I got? Builder potion, some st couple stars, or a few stars. Stone wall. Da -da -da. Let's see. I don't need that in my. What is this? An action bar? Hot bar. Yeah, I don't need my bars in the hot bar. Hmm. I guess that'll be it. Alright, so that was uh, episode one of this new Terraria Let's Play. Um, next time, I'll have a better plan, better idea of what I'm doing. So it'll be, hopefully, easier to watch. I'm sure some of you were struggling watching it, seeing me make all those mistakes, and just not remembering anything. And kind of, I can't open this door. Oh, that's going to be really annoying. Uh, well, I'll fix that too, next time. Alright, well thanks you guys for watching, it's been great, and I'll see you next time.